go. So again, we're gonna do, uh, for warm up today for our lower body workout, uh, we got seven minutes. So you're gonna do three reps each movement. The three movements we're going to do, one is going to be just regular old air squats. Okay. The next one is going to be um, a deadlift. If you have a kettlebell or a set of dumbbells, we're gonna do three deadlifts. If you don't have a weight, you're gonna do elbows on the knees and you got frog squats. Third movement is just a reverse lunge, standing reverse lunge, three each leg. And then you're going to do 20 high knees. For the high knees, just pick those feet up, get those arms pumping. You got 20 total reps. Now for seven minutes, we're gonna do three reps of each, 20 high knees, and then you're gonna add three. Six reps of each, 20 high knees, nine reps of each, 20 high knees making a way uh, as far as you can into this. Don't speed through it, this is just warm up. I'm gonna run through the first bit with you guys and call it out as we go. There we go, starting in 10. So again, seven minutes, we're gonna do three air squats, three lunges, or sorry, three air squats, three deadlift, three lunge each leg, two, one. Here we go, squats to start. A nice, easy air squat. Again, if you have weight, you'll do three deadlifts next. Good hinge over, push your butt back. If you don't have weight, elbows on the knees, frog squats. There we go. After that, you have reverse lunge. Three each leg. And then from there, 20 high knees total. go. We'll move up to six from there. Take your time, sit into your hips, push your knees out. So again, if you don't have weight, elbows on the knees, straighten out at the top. Either frog squats or deadlifts. And then you got lunges each leg. After your uh, lunges, back in the 20 high knees. There we go, guys, keep it going. So moving on from six reps, you're doing nine. Keep it going, guys. Got about four minutes. Again, don't worry about rushing through it. So again, you got your squats, your hamstring squats, your deadlift. Reverse lunge, and then 20 total high knees.
go, guys. Keep it up. Just a good hinge over. Hinging it over for your deadlift. Two more to go. Remember, adding three reps every time. Keep it going, keep it going. Good guys, got about one more minute, one more minute. About 30 seconds, last little bit. Ten seconds. Here we go, three, two, and go ahead and rest it out, all right. Whew. Okay, now that we're nice and warm, here is what we have for today. We have a nice big set we're gonna go through, okay? Uh, it's going to be a 25 minute every minute on the minute, okay? 25 minute, every minute on the minute. Uh, for the first minute, we're gonna be doing some eccentric back squats. I want a good four count on these eccentric back squats. Now, if you have weight, you're going to take your dump, either dumbbells, you're gonna just hold them up on the shoulders, or if you have a kettlebell, you're going to bring it up and around to the backside. So we're gonna hold it right here in the mid back, okay? We're gonna do about 45 seconds or so of these back squats. If you don't have weight, that's okay. I want you to just do one and a half. So you're gonna bounce out of the bottom. If you have weight, we're doing eccentrics. One, two, three, four, and back up, okay? So that's your first minute. Second minute, we have single leg RDL. Now again, either body weight or with a dumbbell or a kettlebell. Good hinge over. You can come to the bottom, you can tap at the bottom, whatever is going to be best for you stability wise. We're gonna do about six to eight each leg. Start with six. If six is too easy, you can move up to eight. Third minute, you're gonna to need to put on your mini band. Now for your mini band, we're gonna put my mini band, here it is. For your mini band, we're gonna have it around the knees. So we'll toss that on after your RDLs. You're gonna get a wide stance. We're gonna do five squats. And then on the fifth one, we're gonna hold here for five seconds. And then we'll do another five squats, hold for five. Another five squats, hold for five. That is your third minute. Your fourth minute, you can actually just keep your minute going on. You're gonna lay down on the ground. We have 15 dead stop 
flip bridges. So you're gonna drive heels in the ground, back down. Heels in the ground, back down. Lift your feet up every single time into that glute bridge. And then our last one is going to be curtsy lunge. Again, we're gonna do about 45 seconds of curtsy lunge. Remember for the curtsy lunge, step back, and you're taking this back knee, get it behind to the outside of that front leg, okay? Drive through your front leg. Make sure when you do your curtsy lunge, don't open up this way. Keep your hips facing straight forward, and we are dropping the hip to that side that we're lunging to. Again, I will walk through the first round with you guys. I know it's a lot to remember. I'll call it out as we go. And uh, yeah, so you'll need your weight. Again, if you don't have weight, you're doing one and a half in this first set, okay? Back squat, good four count eccentric coming up. Starting in 10. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, and get it going. So again, four count. If you don't have weight, I want you to just do this one and a half small bounce out of the bottom and back to the top. Take the time, load the legs. Really sit in two heels. And that's one, two, three, four. And back to the top. Get two more in. Last one. Good, bring it on back. Okay, six to eight RDLs coming up. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, and get it going. Get either with weight or body weight. If you're using with weight, opposite hand of the stance leg, the weight you're aiming to get right to the inside of that front leg instep. Again, six to eight reps. If you're doing body weight, you can probably squeeze that higher end of the rep range in. There we go. Once you finish your RDLs, grab your mini band, toss that mini band on. We're gonna be at above the knees, slightly above the knees. Got about 10 seconds. Next up, five, five, five. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get to it. So five reps. Good pace. Two, three, four, five, and hold. And go. One, two, Three, four, five, and hold. And one more. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and five, and hold. Straighten the heels. Chest up nice and tall. And rest. Okay. Keep that mini band on, down onto the ground. 15 dead stop glute bridge. Starting in five, four, three, two, get it going. So legs up, drive extend, pick your feet up every time. Good squeeze to the top. Once you get through 15, slide your mini band off. Next up, got about 45 seconds for the curtsy lunge. Now for the curtsy lunge, if you have a light weight and you want to do them either down here or up top in that goblet position, 
that works too. That way the weight's in your hands for your, your back squat. You're gonna get right into that after this one. Here we go, curtsy lunge. Five, four, three, two. Let's go. So stepping back, cross behind that front leg. Hips stay forward. Nice and easy. They don't have to be fast. Driving through that front hip. Turn the body a little bit as you do these. Got about 15 seconds. All right, rest it out. Okay, that is one full set through, guys. We got four more. 10 seconds, starting back with back squat. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. All right, bring that weight up. So again, four count. If you don't have weight, you're doing one and a half. Bounce out of the bottom. Get it going, get it going. Keep it up. Keep it going, got about 30 seconds. Good, push the knees out. Don't let those knees collapse in when you're squatting. All right, go ahead and relax. Next up, single leg RDL, six to eight each leg. Five, four, three, two, here we go. Remember, opposite hand to your stance leg, hinge it over, kick that back leg up. Weight is in the opposite hand of my stance leg. So if I'm hinging over on my left leg, I'm holding the weight in my right hand. Now remember, as soon as you get done with these, you're gonna toss that mini band on. your reps grab your mini band toss it on you got about 10 seconds all right squats coming up here we go three two one here we go there's one two three four five and hold Stand it up, and there's one, two, three, four, five and hold, push those knees out. Weight in the heels, and stand, last one. One, two, three, four, five and hold. And rest. Okay. Laying on your back. Five, four, three. We got 15 dead stop loop ribs. Let's go. Pick those feet up. Drive the hips up. Okay, guys, 20 seconds. Plenty time. Next up, 
Turkey lunch. Game 10. Here we go. Three, two, one. Turkey lunch. Go. Keep it up, keep it up. Drop that back knee. Again, don't let your hips turn and open to whatever side you're going to. I want you to drop that hip, push that hip towards the side you're going to. About five more seconds. All right, rest it out, rest it out. Okay, 10 seconds. There's set two. We got three more. Five, four, three, two. All right, eccentric back squat. Keep it up. Nice, good, four count. Get into the hips. There we go, keep it going. Colette, when you're doing those, try to sit a little deeper and push your knees out a bit more. There you go. There we are, much better. So, so you don't wanna squat right here on top of the hips. You wanna be able to sit through into the hips. Keep it up, 15 seconds. Okay, go ahead and rest it out. Here we go, next one. Three, two, one. RDL, six each side. Oh, good hinge over. Keep it going, keep it going. Again, you got six RDLs each side. As soon as you're done, put that mini band on. Okay, 15 seconds. Toss it on that mini band. Up around the tops of the knees. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, and hold. And up. Here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, hold, push the knees out, knees out. Push them out, push them out. And stand, last one. One, two, three, four, and hold. And rest. Here we go. Five, four, three. Down on your mat. Get to it. 15. Dead stop blue bridge. Let's go. feet up, drive them into the ground every time. Doesn't have to be a big amount, you pick them up.
about 20 seconds coming up on our next set of curtsy lunge Here we go, five, four, three, two. All right, curtsy lunge. Let's go, let's go, either with weight or without. Either one's fine, remember, you're dipping your hip as you do that lunge. Doing great, guys, keep it up. Atlanta, how are those legs feeling? <laughs> All right, guys, go ahead and rest. Okay, there's three sets. We got two more times through. Here we go, starting up back at the top. Five, four, three, two. We got back squat. Four count, or you're doing those one and a half. Remember, if you're doing the one and a half, you still really got to push those knees out. Don't squat on top of your hips. Yeah, keep it up, keep it up. back all right go ahead and rest it out set your weight down coming up single leg RDL again six to eight each leg here we go five four three two all right single leg RDL stand it up hinge it over try to look about two three feet ahead of you as you do this. Here we go. Once you're done, grab your mini band if you got one. Go, 10 seconds. Get ready. In five, four, three, two. Okay, here we go. Five squats. There's one, two, three, four, five, and hold. Push your knees out, chest up. Push out against that thing. And up. There we go, next one. There's one, two, three, four, five and hold. And stand it up. Last one, here we go. One, two, three, four, five and hold. out chest up and rest okay heading down onto the mat five four three two oh desktop glute bridge let's go 15 15 desktop glute bridge really drive those heels down to the ground
once you're done with your 15 glute bridges. Oh, take a small break, get about 20 seconds. And we're gonna go into those curtsy lunges. Curtsy lunges coming up. Ten seconds. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Let's do a curtsy lunge. Let's go, let's go. Either with or without weight, either's fine. Here we go, keep it up. Nice work, guys. Keep it going. Okay, about five more seconds. All right, go ahead and rest it out. Okay, last time through. Here we go, five, four, three, two. Pick it up, get to it, let's go. Last one, last set. Nice knees down the way down. Keep it going. Seconds. All right, rest it out. Okay, single leg RDL coming up. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Single leg RDL. Let's go, let's go. Looking at that back leg. Number six to eight reps each side. Really sit your hips back as you're doing this. Remember, once you finish, go ahead and toss that mini band on. Here we go, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two. Okay, five, 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 so here we go. There's one, two, three, Four, five, and hold. Good. Stand up. Next one. Here we go. There's one, two, three, four, five, and hold. And stand. Okay. Last one. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and hold. And stand it up. Okay, five seconds. Down onto your mat. Last set of glute bridge. Oh, dead stop. Get it going. Good drive into the ground. 15 reps.
Okay, guys, coming up. Last set of uh, curtsy lunge. Last set of curtsy lunge. Ten seconds. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Curtsy lunge. Get it going. Let's go. Let's go. Keep it up. Keep it up. Seconds. Here we go. Three, two, one, and rest. All right. Whew. Big set, done and over with. Okay, take a little break. So next up, here's what we're got. Uh, we're gonna do a quick Tabata round. So I'm gonna switch this over. And we are going to alternate legs. So when we alternate legs, uh, we're gonna do left leg first and then right leg first, or right leg second, so. Um, and the movement we're gonna be doing for this Tabata is gonna be a single leg stance diagonal reach. Now you can do this with a mini band on, but you do not need a mini band if you do this one right. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna be one foot in that crouch, good athletic position. Try not to have your hands down on your leg. And then this back foot, your right leg, is going to reach out diagonally, tap, and then bring it back. So all the weight is on this left leg. How that looks from the front here, again, it's just out and tap, out and tap. You can even get the arms going a little bit. So single leg stance, we're gonna move that right foot out diagonally. All the weight stays on the front leg the whole time. So we're gonna do 20 seconds moving the right foot, left leg stance, 20 seconds moving the left foot, right leg stance. Alternating between the two, so we got four rounds of these. All right, again, I'll run through the first bit with you guys. Here we go, starting in 10. So again, left leg stance, right foot is moving. Okay, here we go, set that stance. Three, two, one, right leg moves, let's go. Just a small tap. Again, all the weight is in this front foot. Stabilize the knee, a little bit of arm movement is fine and just barely tap that foot. Now notice my shoulders are not moving. They have a little twist to them, that's okay, but I'm not standing up every time. Stand up and rest. We're gonna shift over to the right foot. Here we go, five, four, three, two. Left leg moving. So again, hips aren't moving. That's staying steady. This whole leg is staying steady. My shoulders don't move, I'm just Keeping that left leg out to the side. Just barely tapping. Three, two, one, and stand. Okay, coming up, switching over. Here we go. Three, two, one, left leg, get it going. Left leg stance, just moving to right. Crouch over, just barely reach out and tap. Now again, if you wanna add some difficulty to it, toss that mini band on around your ankles. Three, two, one, and stand. Switching over, right foot. Here we go. Three, two, one, and reach. So again. Upper body stays still, it's not raising or lowering. Three, two, one, and stand. Go and try the mini band. This one's gonna hurt around the ankles. 
left leg stance. Three, two, one. Left leg stance, right leg moving. Now bend your knee as you come forward. Drive against that band if you got a band. Out to the side diagonal. Here we go. Three, two, one, and rest. Here we go. Right leg stance, left leg moving. Oh, that band sucks a lot more. Three, two, one, get it going. Keep it up, keep it up. Three, two, one, and stand. Okay, last one each leg. Here we go. Three, two, one, get it going, right leg. Keep it up, five, Four, three, two, rest and stand. Last one, left leg. Here we go. Three, two, one, get it going. One, and rest it out. Ooh, oh, legs are jello. Right. Okay, guys, so. Ooh, take a small break. We have our last set here. We're only gonna go through it. Twice. Okay. Um, yeah, that should be good. All right, so here's what we're gonna do for our last little deal. Uh, we're going to do a little on the 30 set, okay? First on the 30 set. Uh, first one is going to be single leg power knee. So you're going to come from a kneeling position. You're going to drive through this front leg, jump up, back down. I want you to try to tap your knee every single time. You're going to do five reps on the left. The next 30 second effort, you have 10 kettlebell swings, or you're going to do five squat jumps. Okay. The third 30, we're going to switch over. We're gonna do five reps, driving through the right, having the left leg come up, and then another on the next 30, 10 swings or five squat jumps. We'll take 30 seconds off, and we're gonna run through this two times, okay? Just a quick little finisher set here. I'll run through the first bit with you guys. And yeah, make sure I got my 30 clock up. Here we go, starting in 10. So again, single leg power drive. Let's do uh, right knee down, left leg up. Here we go. Three, two, one. One at a time, guys. Five reps. Drive, back down. There we go. Five reps, okay? Come and do a dead stop every time. Pick that front foot up. Drive through the front foot. 10 seconds. We got 10 kettlebell swings. Here we go. Three, two, one. 10 swings or five squat jumps. Go. We are 10 seconds. Now we're gonna switch over. Left knee down, right leg up front. Three, 
two, one. Driving through that right foot. Take your time. You only have five breaths to do. Again, coming up, another 10 swings or five squat jump. Three, two, one, there we go. take this next round completely off. We get a nice 30 second rest. And then we'll run through that one more time. Actually, we got time. We're gonna do two more. We got two more. Okay, 15 seconds coming up. Right leg down, left leg up front. Again, trying to just work on some hard, solid power. Pick this front foot up, drive into the ground. Five, four, three, two, here we go. There we go, there's one side. Here we go, 10 seconds again. 10 swings or five squat jumps. Five, four, three, two. Let's go, let's go. Okay, 10 seconds, switching over, left and down, right leg up front. Here we go, three, two, one. Try to get that right foot, let's go. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, ten swings. Keep it going. Next round off here, so 30 second rest. And we're gonna run through that one more time and we'll be done. Whew. All right, We've got 15 seconds. So again, we're gonna do right knee down, left leg up. All right, last set guys, last time through. Five, four, three, Two, let's go. Ten seconds. Again, ten swings. For five full squat jumps. Three, two, one. Here we go.
All right, other side. Three, two, one. Here we go. Last side, right side. Oh, legs are jello. There we go. Five, four, three, two. Last set of jumps or swings. Nice job, everybody. Awesome work. Another leg day in the books.